Hello there, nice people. Nuno here. Greetings from Portugal. Today, the 3rd of July, Apple released the iOS developer beta 3. Okay, here on this iPhone 8, we have uh, 570, almost 580 megabytes to download. Okay, let's go ahead and sorry, just a second, put my code over here. So I'm going to make the downloads of this, okay? Also, I'll be making, this is an iPad Air, okay? First generation, the first iPad, okay? And still, I'm going to make a video on this. Also, in the def, in the different uh, video, of course, you know, to make the, perf to see the performance, we have uh, almost uh, 430 megabytes, okay? So, uh, I'll be right back after the download and install to make the usual, you know, uh, go through the new things. Okay, so be right back. Oh, it's done. Let's check the plate is done. Let's check the build number. So let's go to about and the build number. I don't know if you can see. It's the 16A5318D. Okay. So this is the build number for iOS 12 beta 3, okay? Uh, I'm doing also the update on my iPad Air. Let's see if we can see anything that is new. Okay, let's go here to the battery. If there is anything new over here. Again, suggestions from eye level brightness. Okay, very well. So let's see here. Uh, okay, different font here. It was, you know, quite here. It was, you know, uh, the font was smaller on the beta 2 release. On the beta 3, it's a little bit, you know, for you to click is better. Yeah, nice, very well. So, regarding the battery usage, uh, of course, I will, cannot tell you now what is uh my battery now well, i'll wait for uh, perhaps one or two days before i release a new video on this so uh, let's see if we can see anything new about here let's we'll go to the wallpaper see if there is any wallpaper no no new wallpapers over here let's go to the live wallpapers and the dynamic ones no everything still remains the same now uh over here nothing new well this is of course guys the first look for you to to see let's check here how it goes if there is any lag of course i just installed it so perhaps something can can go wrong and some lag let's see here the 3d touch seems pretty responsive guys of course i'll have to check how it runs you know uh, i will release a video in the next few days tomorrow or after tomorrow of course let's load here a website to check if there is okay seems quite fast it is about 580 megabytes as you saw on the beginning let's open a new web a new page over here let's go over there over cult of mac for example let's load it nice seems okay let's open some more apps over here let's go to my library my videos mm -hmm. okay let's put here a, a follow-up for beta 2 let's check uh, the YouTube app you know sometimes okay nice let's open here some apps very well let's go to podcasts good let's go let's see to news so okay very well let's go to the geekbench if it works now no still crashes i'll have to of course in the next video i will uninstall this and install again and see if it works now guys this is what i can tell you now about this you know it seems pretty fluid i'm going through with you now with the video it's a live on no scripts so seems pretty responsive let's multitask over here yeah 
let's quit and see perfect no issues whatsoever so guys uh, just uh, first video expect of course on this iPad Air first generation also a follow-up video uh, regarding performance I like to make videos on older devices okay iPhone 6 it will be also one of the devices that I will I will try to bring to the channel and also I will try and find an iPhone 5s to bring to the channel also because for you audience that have older devices I want you to be you know updated on how they perform okay this is an iPhone 8 and that's an iPad Air first generation my social links are on the side as you can see follow me there I will post there uh, you know uh, when something new comes along and new videos are, are launched and if you are not already subscribed to the channel go ahead and click that subscribe button to keep up to date on these new releases okay also guys just my mac is i'm also waiting for an update for mac os mojave the beta 3 still not available but for you guys that have also max i'll be releasing a video also on that now for now that is all and i hope to see you very very soon bye bye